The snake prince was burned by the fire and was about to be burned by the fire. But then the shepherd stretched out a tree branch to help. The snake prince escaped by following the branch. But the pain on his skin was excruciating. The man poured cool water on the snake prince to ease the pain. To repay the shepherd for saving his life. The snake prince decided to take the shepherd to the snake kingdom. The man asked the donkey to take care of the farmer's sheep. He decided to go alone. He traveled across the grassland and through the jungle. And finally... He and the snake prince came to a huge rock. The snake prince burrowed through a gap and into a hole, and asked the man to move the stone with his stick. The man followed the snake prince down the hole in the rock. The man followed the snake prince down the hole. There was a flash of white light, a gilded gateway of great splendor and splendor. Two thousand-year-old snakes guard the gate. The man was too scared to move, as the gates slowly open. The man followed the snake prince westwards into the palace. The walls are filled with powder blue gold and silver jewelry. Every single one of them was worth a fortune. The snake king, seated on his throne, saw a human intruder. In his anger, he slammed his hand and the whole palace shook. The snake prince saw it and explained to the king how it happened. It was the man who said,